According to authorities, nine persons have been arrested in connection with the suspension bridge collapse that occurred on Sunday in Gujarat, a state in western India, and claimed at least 134 lives. According to senior police officer Ashok Kumar Yadav, the suspects are all connected to Oriva, a Gujarat-based manufacturer of electrical goods that provided maintenance on the 230-meter-long bridge in the town of Morbi. In the Indian state of Gujarat, a suspension bridge fell, killing at least 134 people, including 30 children. Though the precise breakdown is yet unknown, some patients are still in hospitals while others have gone home. Sangavi did not mention the number of those missing when speaking at a press conference in the early hours of Monday, but footage on social media showed scores of people in the river when the bridge collapsed. People were seen grasping the cables and bridge remnants in TV video while rescue personnel made their way to them, according to Reuters. Some managed to scale the demolished building and make their way to the riverbanks, while others swam to safety. According to Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi, the victims' families would get compensation from the Prime Minister's National Relief Fund. At a campaign rally on Monday, Modi said his heart is full with compassion and is with the families of those suffering. Gujarat is holding a state-level election. A commission to look into the occurrence has been formed by the state government.